Hi, I'm Kathy with Harris County Precinct 4 Encore. Thank you for joining us on another Encore excursion. November 11th is Veterans Day. To honor this holiday, we're going to be visiting a few veterans and war monuments in the greater Houston area that pay tribute to our veterans. Located on the median of Broadway Avenue and 23rd, the Galveston World War II Memorial is a tribute to residents of Galveston County that gave their lives in service of their country during the war. This monument was erected by the citizens of Galveston with the support of local members of American Legion Post Number 20, VFW Post Number 880, disabled American veterans, and Jewish war veterans of the United States. Galveston has a rich history that draws national and international travelers to its monuments, museums, and historical sites. This World War II monument is another piece of Galveston pride for local residents. Also at the monument are two benches etched with the names of fallen Galveston soldiers who served during the Korean War. The Deer Park Veterans Memorial is located in front of the Deer Park Municipal Court Building in a picturesque lawn surrounded by large shaded trees. This uncomplicated monument is a dedication to all veterans of Deer Park, listing every branch of the military, including prisoners of war and those missing in action. Visitors of the San Jacinto Monument are a quick drive from the memorial where they can sit under the shade of the trees or explore other unique historical markers in the area. In neighboring Brazoria County, located on the front lawn of the county courthouse, is the Ring of Honor. This memorial is dedicated to the residents of Brazoria County who served in the armed forces and gave their lives in service of their country. Every structure in this memorial features dark, reflective stone that visitors can see themselves in as they observe every image and read every name, quote, and prayer in the monument. Every angle tells a story, which is especially evident in the two statues featured in the memorial. One statue is of young Vietnam veteran and Congressional Medal of Honor recipient, Clarence Sasser. Sasser is a native to Brazoria County who earned this distinguished medal, along with a Purple Heart, for saving lives of his fellow soldiers while under attack and sustaining injuries from machine gun fire. The other statue in the Ring of Honor is the Gold Star Mom, a tribute to the agony and sacrifice of the mothers fathers, and loved ones that lost a soldier on the battlefield. Located in the heart of Houston's Little Saigon on Bel Air Boulevard, the Vietnam War Memorial features a powerful image of a South Vietnamese soldier and an American soldier standing side by side. Their pedestal sits atop nine steps, which is a lucky number in Vietnam. Behind them are three flags, South Vietnamese, United States, and Texas. This memorial was designed by Houston-based artist Thong Pham and architect Niep Nguyen, whose families fled Vietnam during the fall of Saigon. Behind the monument is a smaller but equally striking statue named Refugees, depicting a group of individuals, including a child, each of different descent, heading to face the unknown. Houston is the home to a massive Asian American population from many different backgrounds who sought safety, freedoms, and better opportunities. This monument is a symbol of hope in a bustling part of town that can be appreciated by visitors of all backgrounds. Dedicated in November of 1999, the World War II Memorial, located in the Houston Heights, serves as a tribute to residents who served in the armed forces during World War II. In addition to listed names, 
this memorial includes some very unique features. One feature is the Freedom Walk, made up of bollard posts surrounding the memorial that illustrates significant battles in the war. One of these posts is a tribute to Houston native, Lieutenant Raymond L. Knight of the United States Army Air Force. He was posthumously awarded the Medal of Honor for his brave actions in the war. Within his bollard post is a buried time capsule sealed in October of 2001 to be opened in the year 2050. Its inscription says that it is a testament to the lives of the brave Heights men and women who served in World War II and the sacrifices made to preserve freedom both here and abroad. Located in Houston's East Tex Jensen neighborhood on Tidwell Road, just outside of the Hardy Toll Road, is Veterans Memorial Park. In the park are two art installations that honor those who served in the United States military. One is the Witness to Freedom installation. Created by Houston resident Rosalindo Toro, this artwork includes a round central plaza containing bronze reproductions of 16 military medals awarded for discipline, courage, and sacrifice. Nearby are vertical structures that resemble the trees that bore witness to American soldiers in combat, plantain trees from the Spanish-American War, laurel trees from both world wars in Europe, and bamboo trees from the Korean and Vietnam Wars. In these tree structures are pieces of military equipment soldiers would have used throughout history. Absolute Victory is the name of a mosaic art structure in the park that pays tribute to veterans of World War II. Directly in front of this structure, inlaid in a circular plaza, is a pentagon that includes campaign maps and mosaics showing World War II battles with strategies for victory. Located within Precinct 3's Bear Creek Park, the Harris County War Memorial was first constructed in 1985. It lists the names of Harris County residents who died in service in wars and conflicts beginning as early as World War I. Under the direction of Precinct 3 Commissioner Steve Raddick, the memorial has been expanded to include more soldiers' names, including casualties of the United States Merchant Marines during World War II, the United States Coast Guard, and names that were misspelled or left off because of limited space. Because this memorial is located within a park surrounded by beautiful landscaping, Visitors of the monument can have a peaceful and welcoming place to reflect upon the local soldiers that lost their lives in war. The Fallen Warriors Memorial is located within Cy Champ Park in Northwest Houston. This memorial was dedicated in October of 2012 with the help of National Memorial Ladies, Cy Champ Planned Urban Development, and local donors. The memorial is a dedication to the fallen Texans who served in operations Iraqi Freedom, New Dawn, and Enduring Freedom. Its natural surroundings allow for tranquil reflection while hearing monument speakers read aloud every name that's etched in the memorial. Also featured at this location is a service dog memorial honoring two four-legged heroes. Eli is a retired military dog who faithfully served his handler, 20-year-old Marine Private First Class Colton Rusk until his untimely death when a Taliban sniper shot and pierced his helmet. 
Eli faithfully remained with Rusk until fellow Marines arrived. Rusk's family adopted Eli with the comfort of knowing Rusk did not die alone. Eli is now enjoying his retirement in Orange Grove, Texas. Brittany was a member of Texas Task Force One and the Sci Fair Volunteer Fire Department. She was the last surviving 9 11 Ground Zero search and rescue dog who, after retirement, served as a reading dog for a local elementary school. Brittany passed in 2016 at the age of 16 in Cypress, Texas and she was saluted at the sidewalk by firefighters and rescue workers as her family carried her body draped in a Texas flag. This memorial is a tribute to all service dogs who were the life-saving heroes to military personnel and veterans after returning home from duty. If you wish to visit these monuments and memorials, click the link below or visit Precinct 4 Encore's website for a map of each location. To all veterans, we thank you for your service. We hope to see you at Commissioner R. Jack Cagle's virtual tribute to veterans on November 11th at 6 o'clock p.m. on Precinct 4's Facebook page. Thank you for joining us for another Encore excursion. We look forward to seeing you at our next destination.